Hello my fellow musers, stargazers, daydreamers, my name is Mystic, these are my hands, and welcome to my channel. So I had every intention for my first video to be completely different. I was sharpening my editing skills on a video that would have showcased my plans for this channel rather nicely. However, after one catastrophic failure to understand how technology works and three weeks of arduous editing down the drain, here I am, humbled to the core. So when Jazza announced his Remake My Mural competition, I thought, I can paint and I need a break from my originally scheduled broadcast, so what the heck. I've been following his competition prompts for a while now, even sketching up some ideas for a few of them, but I've never gotten up the courage to actually enter. So here goes nothing. Let me just say that as an artist, I haven't been able to do many things that were just for me. Don't get me wrong, the joy that comes from having an idea in my head and then actually seeing it take shape under my fingertips is all I really need. However, to work for countless hours on a piece that I'm extremely proud of, only to present it to the person I made it for and never see it again is very tiring. Not to mention the pain that comes from visiting their house and not seeing it hung up on the wall or, God forbid, being used as a coaster. It's really easy to forget the things you've created in this type of situation. Out of sight, out of mind is a concept for a reason. So as a person with less than great self-esteem, having a painting I'm really proud of displayed in my own home is invaluable. So thank you, Jazza, for the inspiration. To start out the segment where I try to explain my creative process, I thought I'd mix it up and tell you through verse. Enjoy! In a moment of the mundane, inspiration strikes, a ready heart after a lull of anticipation is provoked. The dam breaks. Imagination rushes out in creation, a gift so eternal that time stands still. I speed off into the incomprehensible. Cascades of color, gusts of verse, rushes of prose. Time has no meaning. Its tick is silenced, its momentum dashed. Replaced by this trance, this dance this flight of the muses. So if you still don't understand what I'm trying to get at, which is 
extremely likely, as there's entire college classes dedicated to translating what poets might have meant. Here's what I actually mean. Any hobbyist might have already caught my drift. But there's this trance that happens in the midst of creating that almost feels hypnotic. You sit at the canvas or piano or keyboard and out rushes pure creation. When it's over, sometimes you look back at something that you don't recall making the decision to do. An entire chapter of beauty a little blend of colors that just work. An arpeggio that you hadn't thought of during the planning stage, but is on the page now. And then your kids are in the room, demanding food because you worked through lunch and it's now dinner time. It only felt like a moment. I hold back no false modesty. I am completely aware that cringe could very well end up being the top comment on this video. Poetry is not everyone's cuppa. But never apologize for doing what you love. The purpose of this channel, and really art in general, is to be a blank slate. A place that's empty and without form where my spirit can hover and simply create. So this is me in the beginning. I have been mystic. Those were my hands and let there be light.